All right, Carolyn, you ready for some rapid fire questions? Uh, ready as I'll ever be. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Okay. Where are you from? Uh, Reading, Mass. Favorite 90s jam? Um, it's gonna be Mbop by Hanson. <laughs> Don't judge me, anyone. <laughs> what TV character do you identify with? Um, I think I'm gonna go with Leslie No Parks and Rec. What's the name of your fictional debut album? Uh, cool, Calm, and Escalated. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we most likely to find you outside the Bullhorn office? Um, I'd say the beach or down in Cape Cod at my parents' place. If you weren't in your current role, what would you be doing? For talking practically, probably recruiting. <laughs> <laughs> Describe your high school self in one word. Oh, awkward. <laughs> Unless you do like super awkward as hyphenated, <laughs> that would that would work too. <laughs> What's your biggest pet peeve? Oh, this happened happened literally to me yesterday. It drives me nuts. People that eat like a full meal on the train, <laughs> not the train, like specifically on the T. It's disgusting. <laughs> What's your favorite food? Okay, so this is a loaded question because I love all food. But uh, we'll go for meal, chicken, broccoli, ziti. But for single, like, substance, maple walnut ice cream. It sounds delicious. Yeah, I like that right now, actually. <laughs> <laughs> What's your least favorite food? Olives, hands down. Oh. Olives. Any olives. I'm with you on that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's your dream concert? Can I do two? Yeah. Okay, so... Adele, because I don't think she's ever going to tour again, and I would still love to see her. Or a concert that I've already seen, which is embarrassingly Glee Live. <laughs> What's your favorite place to eat? Um, so many again, but uh, Strega, the waterfront one, is my favorite. <laughs> Movie or TV show you're ashamed to admit you love? Well, there, okay, there's <laughs> two that I watch religiously every night, and it's Hoarders and My 600 Pound Life. <laughs> so basically anything on like TLC. <laughs> Weirdest fashion trend you've ever participated in? So this goes back to my super awkward slash awkward high school years, but I used to wear bandanas every day to school. <laughs> I had one of every color, and I'd roll it up into a headband. It was a hockey thing. All, the, all Every girl that plays hockey needs to put a bandana on, so. All right, what's the top item on your bucket list? Um, I think go to Fiji. Slash, now that I saw the President's Club video, I want to swim with pigs. <laughs> Even though I heard that they bite, I still will take that chance. If Hollywood made a movie about you, who would they cast as the lead role? Okay, so we're gonna have to split this because early years I would say like Chloe Kim, snowboarder. <laughs> she should break into acting though. Post years would be Constant, Constance Wu. I like it. Yeah. I like it. Mm -hmm. And lastly, what's your favorite quote or line from a movie? Um, I think it's been my favorite quote since high school. But Eleanor Roosevelt has a quote that no one can make you feel inferior without your consent and I might have flubbed that up, but general point. <laughs> All right, I yeah. like it. Yeah, cool. Well, thanks for coming on, Carolyn. This has yeah. been a blast. Awesome, Ben. Thanks for having me. It was great.